The universe can be understood through ten dimensions, each one building upon the last. The zeroth dimension is a single point, a location with no size, no length, width, or depth. It's simply a position. Extend a line from that point and you get the first dimension, length. In this dimension, you can only move forward or backward along the line. Expand that line into a plane and you have the second dimension, which has length and width. A 2D world is flat, allowing movement left and right in addition to forward and backward, but with no concept of up or down. The third dimension adds depth. This is the world we experience, filled with objects that have volume. We can move up, down, left, right, forward, and back, perceiving the distance and shape of everything around us. The fourth dimension is time. It allows for change, connecting the past, present, and future. While we perceive time as flowing forward, Einstein's theory of relativity shows that it's relative. It can stretch and shrink depending on an object's speed and the strength of gravity. The fifth dimension introduces the idea of parallel universes. Imagine that every choice you make could create a new, branching timeline. This dimension contains these alternate realities based on different outcomes. The sixth dimension is a plane containing all these possible timelines. From this perspective, you could view every possible past, present, and future branching from every decision point. The seventh dimension contains the multiverse. This is a collection of every possible universe, each with entirely different starting conditions and its own unique laws of physics. Some might be like ours, while others could be completely alien. The eighth dimension is the interconnected web of all these different universes. It reveals how timelines from separate multiverses might connect, branch off, and influence one another. The ninth dimension contains every possible law of physics and all initial conditions. A being here could theoretically create any conceivable universe by simply defining its fundamental rules. Finally, the tenth dimension is the ultimate singularity. Here, everything imaginable and unimaginable is compressed into a single point. All possibilities, timelines, and universes exist at once, beyond our understanding of space and time. It is both the beginning and the end.